Breaking news today Defkin warning system at safest level but experts warn North Korea simply buying time The Defkin warning system has issued a cautious update continuing its safest level status despite experts warning North Korea is simply buying time to repair its nuclear testing site. The Defkin warning system, a private intelligence organization monitoring nuclear threats against the USA, remains at level 5 the lowest possible, according to an update released on Thursday at 7 p.m. PDT. Friday 3 a.m. GMT. It comes despite Vladimir Putin's announcement yesterday that Russia had developed a terrifying array of nuclear weapons that can reach anywhere in the world and are invulnerable to enemy interception. Analysts for Defkin also considered the North Korea's alleged olive branch during last month's Winter Olympics as experts fear Kim Jong-un's engineers were simply using the time to continue repairs on the nation's nuclear testing site which suffer significant damage in November 2017. While there are currently no imminent nuclear threats against the United States the warning system appears to be cautiously optimistic. A statement from the Defkin warning system added, most analysts believe that this pause is temporary and that North Korea is simply using the time to continue repairs to their nuclear testing site. It is believed that North Korea is continuing to make progress with long-range missiles and will continue its nuclear work. Nevertheless, North Korea has invited South Korea for a summit in North Korea and the United States now says ready for talks if not negotiations with North Korea. The intelligence organization has also been monitoring China after Beijing boasted that it had successfully carried out a land-based mid-course missile interception test and deployed its J-20 stealth fighter into combat service. Referencing Russia's new super nuclear weapons the Defone warning system said, Russia has just announced a hypersonic missile which it claims cannot be intercepted and can carry a nuclear payload to anywhere in the world. The Defkin warning system notes that Russia has a history of making exaggerated or false claims in an effort to make an enemy believe Russia's military is more formidable than it really is, and there are concerns that Russia has made such an announcement without any visible testing. At this time, the Defkin warning system is unsure of the validity of Russia's recent claim and is continuing to investigate. However another expert warned that Mr. Putin's announcement marks a new arms race that will put us under the terror of a new Cold War as Russia, North Korea, China and the US all participants in the last Cold War continue to build up their military arsenal. Beatrice Finn, executive director of International Campaign to Abolish Nuclear Weapons, ICAN, said, Putin's statement makes it clear we are in a new arms race that will put us under the terror of a new Cold War, in constant fear of death at any instant. While Russia and the US compare the size of their arsenals, the rest of the world is joining a treaty that bans them. Mr. Putin's during his speech to the Russian Federal Assembly on Thursday boasted Moscow had developed missiles that no other nation possesses. And in a thinly veiled threat to the West, the Russian president said, Russia remained a nuclear power, but no one wanted to listen to us. Listen to us now. Mr. Putin's remarks were later echoed by Russia's defense minister Sergei Shoigu who further accused NATO countries of trying to drag Moscow into a new arms race. Thanks for watch please subscribe channel for latest news.